What's up guys, what's going on? Camp out coming at you with a review. As you can see, we got a Nike box, something we're definitely not used to on this channel, but I'm gonna roll this up. Uh, five decades of basketball. They had a release party at Kith. If you guys didn't catch the vlog, it's definitely up there. You can definitely peep it, uh, see what the party looked like on the inside. And these were one of the shoes that dropped through the pack. So five decades of basketball. Okay, there's a truck outside. Five decades of basketball. Um, there was four, oh, Four, and then there was the, the sock line. I forget the name of the shoe, but either way, these are the Air Zoom Generation LeBron, whatever you want to go with. They are size 11. I picked them up. I don't know if I'm going to keep them though, so we'll, we'll see what happens. Slide box, and we're just going to pull these bad boys out. Vanchetta. Vanchetta Lego. Very, 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 very fire shoe. I did pick up another shoe for this collection. Uh, I will do that in a separate review. It'll be next, but either way, I'm just gonna turn this down and turn this up. Overall, quality is fire, colorway is clean if you like that wheat vanchetta color. Uh, material is definitely on point. Price point wasn't too crazy. I think they were 190 to 11 after tax or something like that. You got a couple of hits of rose gold across uh, some accents here, so your aglets are rose gold. Aglet in here is rose gold. You have a nice twine lace on this bad boy, but the entire shoe is one solid piece of fanchetta leather. You got a perforated hit across the uh, ankle area and the lower portion of the heel counter. I'll roll that around. There is a sticker on here that let you know that the chrome finish will peel off. I'm gonna take this sticker up a little bit. I don't wanna get too crazy, but as you can see, there's a rose gold wrap on the heel portion of this uh, the shoe that matches the rest of the hits on it. You got the same wrap around the toe capping or in between the toe capping or toe wrap and midsole. Midsole is gum, very, very fire. Uh, medial side is mirrored. There's nothing really crazy about the shoe as far as detail work goes. Um, oh, overall, very, very, very fire shoe, and I would never really buy a LeBron. I thought it was dope. Ronnie had it on that night. Um, it looked clean with his fit or whatever it was. I don't have any pictures of that, but it is what it is. And uh, overall, just very, very fire. As you can see inside there, it says, Le oh, you might not be able to see that because the light is kind of shitty. It says LeBron on the footbed of the shoe. It says LeBron on the other foot, better the shoe. You might not be able to uh, roll it around a little bit so you can see what's going on in there. Uh, aglet, you got a rose gold aglet to match the rest of the shoe. And uh, that's pretty much it. I, I don't know if I'm gonna do an on foot for these just because uh, I might be giving them up. Uh, one of my friends really wanted them and I decided that if I did pick them up and I didn't like them, I would give them to him. Uh, retail, of course, that's how we do things. But overall, if you guys liked the review, shoot me a thumbs up. Uh, if there's any questions about anything ascertaining to the shoes, I think they're doing a wider release this weekend of this pack. Uh, I've seen a couple of stores putting up some shoes. When I do the other review, I'll mention that as well. And uh, if you're not subscribed yet, hit that subscribe button. Peace.